What's going on everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today I've got another NBA video discussion video to kind of go over with you guys. This time actually revolving around the Milwaukee Bucks and Giannis Antetokounmpo. And it currently being reported that the Golden State Warriors will potentially look to make a run at Giannis. And it's kind of been in the working for quite a while. So we've known for some time now they have had interest in Giannis. I mean, it's no real secret about that. I mean... The Bucks do really want to partner Giannis with Steph and Clay, and I think honestly that might be the greatest trio to ever exist on you know in the NBA. Because if you think about it, yes, Kevin Durant was really good with those, those two players, but imagine a slasher, you know, the ability to have the slashing ability that Giannis has. And if he is, you know, getting tag teamed or something in the paint or he can't score, which, you know, usually doesn't happen anyway, you can just kick it out to Clay or Steph will be on the line and you get a pretty good, you know, pretty good three right there that most likely will go in because you got two of the greatest three-point shooters around you. Like, I think, yes, some people probably say that, you know, Dennis Rodman, Michael Jordan, um, Scottie Pippen are the greatest trio. Some people may look at Dwayne Wade, LeBron, and Bosch. You know, some people may look at Durant, Steph, and Clay. But honestly, I think this may be one of the best. And yeah, again, it's probably going to go top three if this was to happen. The only thing is Steph and Clay are a little bit on the older age. But just imagine Giannis with a bunch of capable three-point shooters like that. That would literally be absolutely insane. Like, I'm not going to lie. That would be a very interesting sight to see. And I don't know if I necessarily would like it to happen, but it's currently being reported that the Warriors have been preparing um, for years to make a run for Giannis. This is being reported by San Francisco Chronicle. Also being reported as well by the same people, Warriors believe NBA lockdown will help them land Giannis. Also, for those of you who haven't heard, Giannis pretty much got hacked on multiple things. I believe he actually, like, the per the person that hacked him, like, kind of requested a trade on social media to the Warriors. They said, I want to go to the Warriors or something like that, which, again, has brought up a lot of rumors on, you know, more and more of Giannis and the Warriors being real linked to each other. But, again, everyone's out here. I, I see people in the comments talking about that. How cool would it be to see Giannis go to the Warriors? But these were also the same people that complained about Kevin Durant and the Warriors. So, again, if Giannis was to go to the Warriors, I could definitely see them complaining about that straight after again as well. You know, saying that Giannis went to a super team, etc. So, again, <laughs> I don't even know how to make of that. Like, I mean, yes, I, I don't think I really want Giannis to go to the Warriors as well. I feel like we've had enough of these super teams and all this type of stuff. It would be kind of cool to see some, you know, competitive like that we've had throughout this season, which has so far been a really good season until kind of now where it's been a little bit flipped on its head. But, there, you know, there are a couple of teams that I think could be trying to build a super team. Golden State, I think, are definitely trying to build one with Steph, Clay, and Giannis. Miami are going to be building, or trying to build one with, you know, Jimmy Butler, Bam Adebayo, Victor Oladipo, and Giannis, who are all in their sights as well. Again, it is literally just continuing on multiple teams that are really wanting to build a super team. Hopefully, though, I actually don't want... I don't really want Giannis to go to Golden State. I think it'd be kind of cool to potentially see, but after a while, you just see that there's been another super team in the league, and again, I'm not exactly too sure if I would really like that at all. And yeah, I kind of like the competitive of you know competitiveness of the NBA right now, so if there's any team I'd really want him to go to, I think going to the Miami Heat would be a pretty cool team. You know, going to Miami and playing with Jimmy Butler, who's one of my favorite players in the NBA... And, you know, partnering up with Bam Adebayo, I think that would be a, a pretty good, you know, trio that would be not necessarily a super team, but I think would become one of the best teams in the league. And, yeah, it would be actually really nice to see. He'd have a really nice foundation around him, too, of players such as Tyler Hero, Kendrick Nunn, Duncan Robinson, potentially Goran Dragic, etc. So many players he'd have around him, and I think that would definitely be better than that Bucks team. Obviously, on the Bucks team, he's got a bunch of really nice role players. Then he's got one of the best role players in the NBA, you know, role players, stars, um, in Chris Middleton, who, again, is definitely a star, but plays that role of that three-point shooter for Giannis so very well. And then you got, obviously, a bunch of players here and there. Or he could have Bam Adebayo, one of the best young centers in the league. And then he could potentially have Jimmy Butler, one of the best defenders and a really good player in the league. And then obviously, possibly better role players around him at Miami. I'm not too sure who would have the better role players. But I think if he went to Miami, that would overall probably be a better team than what he necessarily has at the Milwaukee Bucks right now. But again, 
I don't necessarily know. I've never exactly been, you know, too much of a fan of this Giannis Golden State type of thing. I think it would be kind of bad and rough to see another super team in the league, and I don't necessarily know if I'm going to be prepared for that. And I think a lot of people are really underestimating on how, you know, the league has been kind of corrupted by Golden State and their super team for the past couple of seasons, and that they're saying that it'd be cool for Giannis to go to Golden State, but then are also going to be complaining when Giannis builds a super team and they win a lot of games and possibly win the championship and, yeah, build another super team in Golden State. So, again... I'm not exactly too happy about this one. I don't know if I necessarily like it too much. Obviously, Golden State fans are going to be extremely happy. There's another player that may potentially go to their team. But, of course, I think I would like to see maybe Giannis go to the Miami Heat. I think that would be a pretty cool thing. And that's just what I've kind of got. You know, Jimmy Butler and uh, Bam Adebayo and Tyler Hero, etc. I think would be really cool to kind of see all partner up and, yeah, be on a team. But anyway, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to, my, uh, subscribe to the channel for all the latest NBA and sports-related content. Also, don't forget to comment in the comment section down below. What are your thoughts and opinions on the Golden State Warriors being interested in Giannis? Again, I definitely would really like to know your thoughts and opinions on this all down below. But yeah, of course, also don't forget to subscribe to my gaming channel, Emma IRL slash long channel. Links for them will all be in the description down below. And don't forget to check out my podcast as well if you haven't already. We're just a bunch of NBA content, all of that, um, you know, well, sports-related content, actually, all that type of stuff. Links for that will be in the description down below. So as I was saying, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.